it's a fact that we are always manifesting while we are meeting a friend when we are thinking when we are journaling when we are just trying to visualize what we want we are always in the process of bringing true to our life whatever we are thinking but have you ever experienced this or have you ever connected the dots that you are also manifesting while you are watching a movie while you are binge watching on the tv series episodes that have just come out and you are just watching them because they are so interesting you are also absolutely manifesting when you are listening to music or a podcast This is a very important episode for you and I can promise you by the end of this episode the way you consume media is going to change forever. Make sure that you listen to this episode very carefully because I'm going to be asking you a question by the end of the episode which is going to make you think and that thought process is going to be a game changer in your life. Hello and welcome to episode number 25 of Manifest with Paycheck to Profit. a podcast designed to help you make sense of law of attraction so that you can manifest more wealth into your life get financially free improve your money mindset and get rid of your money blocks i am manish auja your financial mindset your money mindset and financial literacy coach founder of paycheck to profit paycheck to profit is a community for millennials and gen zs who want to build a new relationship with money who want to get more financially secure by changing the way they feel about money and get in the zone of abundance negativity sells in media and hence a lot of media content is generally negative you need to understand one thing that i am going to be sharing with you seven ways in which your media consumption is completely destroying your process or your manifestation journey and sabotaging your law of attraction practice let's get started with the first point which is as i was mentioning negativity in media is so common that your negative consumption of media or consumption of negative media is going to give rise to negative thoughts which is going to expand on your negative beliefs and negative emotions which will lead to negative money mindset and will have negative results in your life have you ever thought how are rich people portrayed in media it more often than not for drama purposes rich people are generally portrayed to be evil insensitive self centered and they are never portrayed in a good light most villains shown in media are rich people why is that the case there are so many rich people today who are indulging in philanthropic activities who are sharing their wealth with people with the lower strata of the society so that they can actually progress and become and have confidence to live a much better life look at it from this point of view if you consume so much media that shows rich people to be negative in all ways and forms your subconscious mind the second reason why uh, media consumption is destroying a manifestation is because it is affecting your subconscious mind if in your subconscious mind the impression that you have of rich people is negative how will you ever be able to reach a place where you will look at rich people as an aspirational thing to achieve you may want a lot of wealth in your life but if on a subconscious level you are thinking about rich people to be negative your perception towards rich people will always be negative and it will always keep showing in your mindset and because of which your subconscious mind will not allow you to get wealthy it will always find ways to hold you back from actually experiencing and unlocking the abundance that you deserve if you really want to change this perspective you really need to start taking small steps take a small step right now go to the comment section below the like button and write the words i am a money magnet as a comment it is going to take you just 30 seconds but that is also going to be one step towards you improving that is also one step of you trying to tell your subconscious mind that you want to change your uh, you want to change your mindset and become a money magnet go ahead and write that comment in the comments below i am a money magnet the third way media is sabotaging your law of attraction practice is by giving you endless raw material to think over uh, overthink in the negative manner i can give you this as an example with with regards to songs 
हैव यू एवर बिन थ्रू अ ब्रेकअप वेयर यू ऑटोमेटिकली वर ड्रॉन टूवर्ड्स लिसनिंग टू अ लॉट ऑफ नेगेटिव सॉन्ग्स और सैड सॉन्ग्स इमेजिन द इम्पैक्ट दैट इट टेक्स द माइंड सेट दैट इट क्रिएट्स यू एक्चुअली फॉर अ टाइम बींग गेट अ लॉट ऑफ कम्फर्ट आउट ऑफ दोज नेगेटिव सॉन्ग्स सैड सॉन्ग्स बट यू आर ऑल्सो साब यू आर ऑल्सो फीडिंग योर ब्रेन दैट यू नाउ आर नॉट रेडी टू गेट इन टू अ न्यू रिलेशनशिप यू एक्चुअली ब्लॉक योर सेल्फ फ्रॉम अट्रैक्टिंग लव टेम्पररी बिकॉज ऑफ द काइंड ऑफ सॉन्ग्स दैट यू आर लिसनिंग टू नाउ इमेजिन दिस द रीजन इफ दिस पॉइंट इज रेजोनेटिंग विथ यू थिंक अबाउट ऑल द टाइम वेन यू आर थिंकिंग नेगेटिवली अबाउट मनी रिच पीपल इन्फ्लेशन द काइंड ऑफ पॉलिसीज दैट द गवर्नमेंट इज मेकिंग द वे स्टॉक मार्केट इज क्रैशिंग एवरी थिंग विल कनेक्ट टूगेदर इट्स जस्ट दैट यू नॉट बीन एबल टू कनेक्ट दीज डॉट्स बिकॉज यू नेवर थॉट अबाउट इट दिस वे फोकसिंग ऑन पॉजिटिविटी इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एंड वन वे पेचेक टू पेचेक टू प्रॉफिट कैन हेल्प यू फोकस ऑन द पॉजिटिव एस्पेक्ट इज बाय मी गिविंग यू एन इन्विटेशन टू बिकम अ पार्ट ऑफ द प्रॉफिट प्लान in the show notes and the description of this show of this episode you will find a link to become a part of the profit clan if you are just listening to this episode or watching this episode and cannot go to the description let me just read out the link to you very quickly it's paycheck to profit.com slash profit clan p a y c h e c k t o p r o f i t.com slash p r o f i t c l a n go to this link become a part of the profit clan a profit clan is the email community where you will get access to rich knowledge positive information and positive content towards improving your money mindset getting rid of your money blocks you'll also get invites to uh, exclusive master classes that i do for the paycheck to profit community please do not miss out on this opportunity obviously this is free so you should be the first in the line to become a part of the profit clan if you've been listening to this episode for this long the fourth way media is sabotaging your law of attraction practice is by building new beliefs and reaffirming faulty beliefs of the past let me give you an example of this stock market has always been a scam and yet all rich people have made a lot of money through stock markets what gives do you remember just a few years ago the kind of hoopla that was made with regards to cryptocurrency all foreign all currencies will become obsolete only digital and cryptocurrencies will rule the roost where are cryptocurrencies today NFTs are going to become the only form of investment that will exist. Where are NFTs today? Media created a lot of hype. Media created a lot of money. Some people of the media created a lot of money, and those scams were busted. And today, so many founders of those uh, cryptocurrency wallets have now. They don't even. Nobody knows where they are. media is only going to focus on their own profit and if their profit comes at the cost of your loss media is not going to bother so please be very 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 careful media is actually very strongly responsible for creating new beliefs but it is your responsibility to consume the right sort of media and only create beliefs which are actually factually correct so be very careful the fifth way media is creating a negative impact on your money mindset or sabotaging your law of attraction is by creating an echo chamber the kind of media that you consume it will make you feel that you need to buy things you need to experience the new restaurant go to this country buy everything on emi or swipe your credit card more often or get into the sneaker culture consumerism is at its peak today and one of the reasons why that is happening is because the whole the whole feeling of fomo that media is trying to create for you look at the kind of way your consumption patterns have changed in the last few years and you'll realize what i'm trying to say when i say that media creates an echo chamber the sixth point that i want you to think about which is directly affected to media is that every time you are consuming negative media the look at the kind of time investment that media demands out of you this is one thing that people tend to overlook and that is one thing which is costing you the most because time once lost is never going to come back i told you earlier in the episode that i'm going to ask you a very important question you've already listened to 6 out of 7 points that i have to share with you 
the question that I have to ask you is after listening to these six points, do you commit to yourself to be more mindful with the kind of media that you will consume from this moment on? You could not have listened to 10 minutes of me blabbering if this was not resonating with you. I am not going to benefit if you consume more positive media, but you are, your life is definitely going to change. Media is very powerful. 66% people in the world are very heavily influenced by the visuals that they see. Everybody gets impacted by the kind of things that you hear. Be very, very, very careful, my friend, with regards to the media that you're consuming. The seventh and the most important point, which will prove that media is having a direct impact on the way you are living your life and it is impacting your law of attraction practice is the fact that when you consume negative media, what you are actually doing is you're signing a contract that you are going to take double, triple, four times the time to actually unlock your success. Now, let me explain to you how this works. Imagine you have a room that you're supposed to paint and the wall that you are and the color with which you're supposed to paint this wall is blue color. Now, blue color metaphorically is the positive uh, manifestation that you're trying to get into your life and the negative media that you're consuming is the proverbial black color. Now what is happening when you're consuming negative media is that you're painting the entire room first in black in color. Then you're realizing, oh, I have lost so much time, effort, energy and resources by painting this entire room black. Now black color cannot be painted upon directly. So you'll have to now repaint the entire room in white color, take off and scrape off the black color and then apply the blue color coating. Are you now understanding when you are consuming negative media, eventually you will have to turn towards positivity and to turn towards positivity. First, you are investing the time by consuming negative media. Then you are completely messing up with your money mindset. Then you are applying the white coat of getting neutral and then you will get positive. That is how media is literally sabotaging your manifestations. Let me very quickly run you through all the seven points that I've shared with you. Negativity sells in media and hence a lot of media is made to be negative in, on purpose. They portray rich people in a very negative light. The second point being, if you look at rich people to be bad people as villains on a subconscious level, your subconscious mind will associate being rich or wealthy with being bad and hence yourself, uh, your subconscious will start sabotaging your thought process and it will stop you from being rich. The third thing, media gives you a lot of raw material to overthink in the negative direction. The fourth thing, the media is extremely powerful and helps you build new belief systems and reaffirms your faulty belief systems. The example of cryptocurrency and NFTs that I mentioned earlier. The fifth point being, Media creates a very strong echo chamber, which is making you consume a lot of things and not focus on investments or growing your wealth and money. The sixth point being that it demands endless amount of time. And the seventh and the last point being that it multiplies the amount of work that you will have to do. You listening to this episode or watching this episode for the last 13 and a half minutes tells me that you are serious about this. You are consuming this to get a new start in your life. I would like to very strongly recommend you to listen to the 12th episode of this podcast, which was titled how improving your self worth will help you attract more money. Now, when you've consumed so much negative media at some level, your self worth has completely gone for a toss and with faulty self worth or with self worth being so low, you are not going to be in a place to or you're not going to be in a position to manifest anything positive into your life. You need this detox. Go to the description and you'll find the link to the 12th episode. Please watch that episode. It's one of my most favorite episodes. Please make sure that you watch that episode. If you've seen it earlier, watch it again. Because with this new perspective of what I have shown with you, I have shared with you, watching that episode again is going to give you a completely new thought process. Thank you so much for listening to this uh, podcast or watching this video till this moment. 
I may I request you to please take a screenshot of this episode, share it on your social media platforms on Twitter, on Instagram, on LinkedIn, and do not forget to tag Paycheck to Profit and Mr. Remojical. Mr. Remojical is my personal ID. When you share this, you are actually spreading the awareness. You are allowing more people to unlock their abundance by understanding more about law of attraction. And I will be super grateful for you to do this. I will make sure that I share your stories on my social media platform so that you and your profile gets an amplification through me as a mark of gratitude. Please follow us on social media. Paycheck to Profit is going to get really active on Instagram and YouTube and I'm going to be creating a lot more content and you can always reach out to me and connect with me and ask me your questions. Who knows the next episode that I create for Manifest with Paycheck to Profit would be inspired by the question that you asked me. If you're listening to this episode on a podcast platform, please take a moment and give this episode a five star rating or a review because it that one rating will ensure that many, many, many people get to know about this episode and this podcast. So it would be very, very, very grateful and it would be very helpful for all of us. Thank you so much for staying connected and watching or listening to this episode till the end. I'll now see you in the next video. A very gentle reminder, do not forget to become a part of the Profit Clan to get all the goodies, freebies, positive content and invite to all the master classes and webinars that I do for the community. If you've been listening to this episode, you can also watch all of these episodes. They also go live simultaneously on the YouTube channel of Paycheck to Profit. And if you've been watching us on YouTube, thank you so much for, for your support. You could also subscribe to pay, uh, Manifest with Paycheck to Profit, the podcast on any podcast application of your choice. Have a profitable week ahead, Profit Heads. It was an amazing episode. Thank you so much for listening till this moment. I will now see you in the next episode that is going to come out on Monday morning, 6 a.m. IST. Until then, keep going, keep growing. Thank you so much.